What is up, you guys? I am Mrs. Torres, your school counselor. Today, I'm answering more of your career questions. One student asked, how is a career actually going to help me? Good question. Well, the benefit of choosing a career path instead of just picking random jobs that have nothing to do with each other is that pursuing a career allows you to make money while doing something you enjoy and growing within that. A career is usually aligned with your passions, your interests, your life goals, leading to greater fulfillment, happiness, and income. How do you start a career? Well, first you have to finish elementary school, middle school, and graduate from high school, moving on to college or some sort of special training related to your future career goals. After that, you can begin looking for jobs that are related to your career, and that is how you start a career. How long can you be in a career? You could be in your career for just a few years or all of adulthood until you retire, which could be up to 46 years in one career. For example, if you want to work with computers, be a software engineer, you might start as an intern with little to no pay, from there, move up to being a junior software developer, then a senior software developer, then a lead developer, software architect, project manager, and eventually senior leader. And this is how you grow within your career, both in your skills and in your pay scale. Many of you asked, is professional athlete a good career choice? Being a professional athlete is an amazing career because it has the potential to make you a great deal of money while getting to play a sport that you love. However, very few high school and college athletes actually make it to the pro level. Becoming a pro athlete takes more than just love of the game. It requires a level of commitment, sacrifice, and self-discipline that not many people have. If this is a dream of yours, practice the skill of self-discipline, which is doing what needs to be done even when you don't feel like it. Work hard and most importantly, don't give up. Now, some of you are wondering, how do I make it to the army or another military branch? Well, in high school, you would have the opportunity to take the ASVAB, which stands for Armed Services Vocational Aptitude Battery Test. Your score on this test determines which branch of military you are eligible for. You must have no serious criminal record, you must pass high school or, or equivalent, and you must be in good health in order to join the military. One student asks, how can I be a better inventor? That's a great question. Think about what problems exist in our world and how can you create creative ways to solve those problems? Don't be afraid to try new things. Get comfortable with making lots of mistakes, failing, and always trying again. Another student asks, what do I need to start a plant company? Well, first you might need knowledge of how to take care of different types of plants. You will need some money to start your business in order to buy seeds or buy plants, pots, things of that nature. Then you'll have to learn how to manage your money and plan for what kinds and how much you will sell each plant for. Make sure you have a space to sell your plants and you'll need to apply for a business license to sell. Create advertisements for your business and start selling. I'll be your first customer. This is for all my performers out there. How do I stop being shy in order to perform in front of others? Well, first things first, you have to get in the habit of speaking good things to yourself. Say, I got this. Have a mindset of progress over perfection. It's not about being perfect and mistakes are okay. Next, practice your skill. Rehearse over and over until you feel confident. Try performing in front of a small group of people that you trust. And the last tip is just to go out there and do it. The best way to get over your performance anxiety is to simply do it. The more you do it, the more confidence will grow. And just like that, we've made it to the end of our video. Don't forget to check out my latest video about answering all of your college questions. Last but not least, remember that your brain is amazing and you can do anything.